Derek ship found floating 10 miles off the Los Angeles coast earlier this morning was towed into the port of Los Angeles a few hours ago. The ship was spotted around midnight by fishermen who contacted the Coast Guard after their attempts to repair the ship were futile. Coast Guard officials are releasing very little information right now, but have identified the vessel as the Elizabeth Dane. No word as of yet as to the whereabouts of the crew, though the Coast Guard are asking any ships that had contact with the Elizabeth Dane to assist them in their search. We'll have more on this story as it breaks. In other news, an apparent third victim of the Southland Slasher has prompted the closing of the Santa Monica Pier, where the body was found earlier tonight. Investigators say the scene closely mirrors those of slayings in Glendale and Long Beach. In both cases, the bodies of the victims were described as ripped, torn, bloody entrails smeared upon the walls, splatter on broken windows, feet in weird places. Murder, murder, murder. Actor Ash Rivers is lucky to be alive after his car crashed into the gate at Parasite Studios earlier tonight. Witnesses say... This area is for hospital staff only. You can let yourself out.
Dr. Buzzman, tell the operator. Dr. Buzzman, tell the operator. Dr. Buzzman, tell the operator. You can let yourself out. is lucky to be alive after his car crashed into the gate at Paradise Studios earlier tonight. Witnesses say that they were shocked when the Negative Zero Star emerged unscathed and apparently unfazed by his high-speed accident. Rivers' agent released a statement stating that Rivers' crash was due to a mechanical problem and that the studio is not pursuing legal action against Rivers for the... Southland 
slasher has prompted the closing of the Santa Monica Pier, where the body was found earlier tonight. Investigators say the scene closely mirrors those of slangs in Glendale and Long Beach. In both cases, the bodies of the victims were described as ripped, torn, bloody entrails smeared upon the walls, splatter on broken windows, feet in weird places, murder, murder, murder. A massive gelatinous creature that washed up on the beaches of Providence, Rhode Island, has scientists scratching their heads found by a jogger early on.